if this doesn't prove that the twin season is cursed, I don't know what does. Mitch Garver, absolutely a cursed victim. Uh, best wishes certainly go out to him. Thinking of him today was obviously in clear pain. I'm not going to show it right now. I'm going to show at the end of this video. I will show what happened in case you don't want to see it. You don't want to revisit it. It was uh, not easy to watch. Uh, he was clearly in a lot of pain and ended up having to go under uh, surgery, emergency surgery at the hospital. Uh, he got hit in a bad spot by a foul ball uh, behind the plate. Now, you know, that's not unusual. Catchers, you know, constantly getting banged up, constantly getting foul balls hit off of them. Never heard, never heard of this before. A guy having to go undergo emergency surgery uh, after getting uh, hit in the groin area with a, with a foul ball. Um, so, yeah, uh, cursed season. Mitch Garver is the latest cursed victim uh, of this uh, 2021 season. And it's a shame too. This is a guy, uh, who was the he, twins daily, uh, hitter of the month for may for the twins. He hit 281 with a 438 on base percentage and a 579 slugging percentage for the month. That is a 1.017 OPS OPS over a thousand for the month. So Mitch Garver, you know, it's been tough to find bright spots with this team and he's been one of the brightest of them all. And, you know, he certainly doesn't, seem like he's going to be catching anytime soon. Um, ben Rortfit was uh, called back up uh, when Max Kepler went down, so he is already on the active roster along with Williams Astadio. He can catch as well. Uh, Ryan Jeffers, uh, he has had a 340 on base percentage and 446 slugging uh, for St. Paul. It's a 786 OPS, so he's performed pretty well down there in AAA. Um, so, you know, Catcher does feel like right now a position that the Twins do have some depth at in terms of other options, um, but just another blow, another hard, you know, tough uh, thing to go through for the this Twins team that's trying to dig itself out of a hole. And obviously, though, the biggest concern is with Mitch Garver. Um, you know, obviously, it's a good sign that he was uh, sharing his news on Instagram, but. Uh, still certainly, you know, worried about uh, him and he was in so much pain. That was tough to watch. It was tough to see. Uh, certainly wishing him a full recovery and hopefully he'll come back soon and play like he has been. Cause uh, again, the guy was on fire, you know, looking like a potential all-star type season that he was having. So, uh, get well soon to Mitch Garver. And I'm going to show just a warning again, if you don't want to see it, I'm about to play that clip. So here it comes. That got Garver. Man, has he been beat up here in the last month? That's gonna hurt Mitch for quite a while. That's I suspect. gonna be a while. Hand on Garver's back. Again, I wouldn't be surprised if he has to come out of the game. He's really in tough shape. Uh, he's trying to go. He's trying to. He's trying to do everything. He's got to come out. He can, that he can.